Did you know that bananas, one of the most popular fruits in the world, are the result of centuries of genetic modification? The banana as we know it today is the result of years of selective breeding by farmers. The original banana which originated in Southeast Asia was very different from the bananas we eat today. It was smaller, contained seeds, and was not as sweet. The first recorded history of the banana dates back to around 600 BCE. Bananas were later introduced to Africa, where they became a staple crop and eventually to the Americas. It wasn't until the late 1800s that bananas became a popular commercial crop in the United States. However, the commercial banana industry faced a major threat in the 1950s when a disease called Panama disease began wiping out banana crops. This led to the development of a new variety of banana called the Cavendish banana, which was resistant to the disease. Today, the Cavendish banana is the most commonly consumed banana in the world. But did you know that the flavor of artificial banana flavoring doesn't actually taste like modern bananas? This is because the flavoring is based on a now extinct variety of banana called the Gros Michel. The Gros Michel was the most commonly consumed banana in the early 1900s, but it was wiped out by Panama disease. The flavor of artificial banana was based on the Gros Michel banana, and that flavor has persisted even though the Cavendish banana has replaced the Gros Michel in commercial production. So the next time you enjoy the taste of banana flavored candy or ice cream, remember that its flavor is based on a banana variety that no longer exists. Despite the loss of the Gros Michel, bananas remain a beloved and important fruit worldwide and genetic modification may play an important role in ensuring their continued production and consumption.